Okay guys, that doesn't really happen in real life, but if you are looking for hijabs that have ear slits, well, in this episode, I try out three different brands. I'm Alex from Awea, and if you're in the medical field, sometimes it's a pain in the gluteus maximus to use your stethoscope or even wear a mask with your hijab. Of course, there are the over-the-head hijab mask options, which you can find right here in this episode. I have like six different brands. Definitely a must-watch episode, but whether you're attending to sick patients, finishing your weekend 5K, or simply running errands, I found three different companies. Of course, I am not sponsored. So let's try out the first hijab from a company that specifically makes medical hijabs. They're called Med Hijabs. They are located in the US. They specialize in stethoscope and mask accessible hijabs. Median, the CEO Hello. of Med Hijabs, actually struggled in nursing school with her hijab, especially when masks were mandated. So she created a solution to help many hijabs Ladies. So let's see how it looks. So this hijab is called the Med. It's around $35. The Med comes in one size and I got the navy color, but you can also get either in black or white. It's made with breathable jersey, which is 95% cotton and 5% spandex. I love that it has these hooks. For your mask, the ear slit is actually in line with my ear. So you can see right here, it's like easily tucked in, has a layered look on top. You can wear the mask and also have the stethoscope. At the same time, it's really easy to use. I actually really like the material. It's thick, so I know that over time it's not gonna be worn, especially if you have to wash this in like a hot wash. It's not like really tight around the neck area, which I don't like, cause then it starts to look more like a gym hijab. Do you know what I'm talking about? Uh, I was really impressed. The ear slit is not uh, really big, but it's great for stethoscope and it actually has kind of like a lining. So even if for instance, you are trying to put the stethoscope in your ear, it has that little space so that it doesn't show your skin. I really like it. I really like how they created this. It's definitely opaque, so it's not see-through material, at least for the navy color. And it's long enough that it could be tucked in, especially with a V-neck scrub. So I really like what you did, Med Hijabs. You did a great job. Uh, so far, I really like it. They also put this cute pen and pad in their um, packaging. So that's really cute, especially if you need to write prescriptions, right? You know how doctors have bad head writing. <laughs> So the second hijab I'm gonna try is called the Culture Hijab Axis 2.0. I got it in indigo blue. It's a second version of their Axis line with a long slit on the side and actually pretty long jersey rectangle hijab. It has a, a very long slit here and you can tuck in the smaller part into your scrubs or whatever you're wearing and then wrap it, wrap, and then wrap the, <clears throat> and then wrap a, what's wrong with me? Wrap it up, wrap it up. A few moments later. So you can tuck in that smaller part in and then just wrap the longer side around. It's made of cotton lycra and about 65 inches in length. So pretty long guys, pretty long. About 26 inches wide. So you can definitely fit a mask over your ears. I think the long slit is great, but can also be a problem because if you're trying to put a mask on, you might show your ears for a few seconds. <laughs> you can see the skin around your ear as you're putting it on. So just to take note, some people have mentioned that it's overly baggy around their face, but for me, it seems fine, but I could see that it could be large for somebody with a smaller face. You might have to use like a magnet or something around your chin area. But for me and my- <laughs> My big face? It was fine. I like that it has a layered look. So it kind of looks like you're wearing an underscarf and you just wrap it over. If you're going for a more casual look or more even a stylish look, instead of just wearing a one piece and you wanna wear it at, in the office or you wanna go walking, this is actually a great hijab to use. I like that you can just cover the ear slits and then if you really need to use a mask, you can just put it on. Um, but it's great also if you just wanna go running, jogging. So far, pretty good. Now, before I talk about the last hijab, if you are enjoying this episode, don't forget to hit that like button and also subscribe if you want more episodes like this one. The last hijab is actually from a company called Fix that creates scrubs that I'm actually making a scrubs episode you can watch right here. So a lot of people were actually either elated or upset with figs for selling a medical hijab. They just came out with it literally a month ago. The thing is that it's great to be inclusive. However, the reason that a lot of Muslim doctors that I've actually spoken with before making this episode are upset is that if you look at it, it was definitely not designed by a hijabi. Because for me, just look at it, it looks like a swim hijab or even a sport hijab versus a daily worn hijab, especially that it has that tight fitted around your neck and then that, you know, long look around your shoulder. 
And it's also not flattering. It's kind of like when Nike Bye. created their first hijab that doesn't really flatter a lot of people's head shape. It's kind of flat. And then you probably have to wear a nicer chiffon hijab over it just to make a nicer look. For me, it definitely looks like the swim hijabs I've tried. The fix hijab actually comes in around $38. It comes in two colors right now. It comes in navy and black. Let's talk about the ear slits. Why is it horizontal? Why did they make slits that are horizontal? It's um, it just doesn't make sense to me. I think they thought like maybe the skin won't show, but as you're lifting it up, your ears are gonna show putting the stethoscope on. It also fits really strange. So when you put the stethoscope in your ears, it looks like the flaps are like sticking out like this or your, your stethoscope sticking out like this. They have two sizes. I got the medium large thinking it's like Nike and runs small, but it's actually pretty big. So it's definitely loose around the rest of my head. It's just gonna be too big around my face. A horizontal um, opening is not that great. I think it should have been vertical. I wish they would consult or even work with a hijab company and that would have made them more inclusive and probably make a better medical hijab. I really hope they change the style because it doesn't look flattering on my head shape. It's more like a swim hijab or even a sports hijab. It just doesn't look great to me. So for me, this was a big no. Although I love their scrubs. I love their scrubs. But this hijab, although it's so exciting to come out with something and seem like they're inclusive, they just should have worked or consulted with hijabis or even medical Muslim doctors to ask them what they really need. So out of all of these items, I think the best one is the med hijab specifically because they make the ear slits right where your ears should be. They make a little hook for your uh, mask and it doesn't really show when you're trying to put the stethoscope in, even working out or just running errands. It's just a more fitted look. If you do like the style where you have like the wrap around your head, then the second best is Culture Access Hijab 2.0 for me. And my least favorite and something that I will probably return is the Figs uh, medical hijab just because it doesn't fit right, it doesn't look nice. I'm not sure who it would look good for, and I don't like the fact that it's a horizontal slit. You can't even put in a mask around your ear, so it's just not worth it to me. I put the links of all the items below. Let me know what you think, which one you would buy. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Definitely check out my other product review episodes and honest reviews right here, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.